Hi everybody, it's Amy from Bargain Beauty and I thought I would show you guys my grocery haul for this week. Nothing super exciting, no great coupon deals. I did get a freebie and I did get some um, good pricing, but I didn't go in with any coupons. I was not in the mood, I was hungry, and I decided to just go in, get it done, because the rest of the week it's going to be so busy in the stores with Thanksgiving. So, I think that... It's kind of funny, you guys love to watch, to like look at my grocery hauls, and I may not get like thousands of view on them, but the watch time on them, you like guys, you guys stay like the whole time, so you must like them, so I'm going to give you more of them. Now, the first thing I got was just some Stop and Shop roast beef. It is not cheap, not cheap at all, but this is probably the only thing I will eat for lunch this week, so it's okay. If I got one sandwich or one grinder at a restaurant or a store, it'd be more than this. So even with all the other things I'm going to use on the sandwich. So $5.19, I did get the Crocus ham. That's my favorite ham ever. And it was $3.33 for a third of a pound. This was a little over half a pound. The Halos, they are on sale with the coupon in the front of the flyer for $2.99. So I grabbed some of those. So I had some fruit for this week. The eggs are not a great deal they're just a dollar 69 but i needed eggs and i didn't feel like going to aldi it's further away from my house i wanted super simple now i've decided to eat a lot less meat so i won't be doing a ton of meat hauls unless it is an amazing deal and i'm trying very hard i can't promise this is always going to happen it's going to depend on my budget but i'm trying really hard to get less meat better quality so i spent 6.99 on these four hamburger patties i have been craving a cheeseburger from home not from mcdonald's not from burger king from the house so i did grab these what i'm gonna do is um use one of them for a cheeseburger i'm gonna divide up one of them and I'd like to take these pastaronis. It's a super cheap and expensive way to eat. And I make the pastaroni and I also um, brown up the ground beef. I take like half of a patty and I put it in with one of these boxes. Oh my gosh, guys, it's so good. It's like a really good hamburger helper. Like hamburger helper is kind of mm, for me, but this is like an upgraded hamburger helper, homemade type of deal. So I'm going to use this for def definite different things other than just hamburgers this was the only meat i could find that looked healthy and that was i like the division because i can actually freeze these individually that's the other reason so the um tomatoes i got these were 2.99 i like the little tomatoes as opposed to large tomatoes for like putting it on a cheeseburger making um just like the tomatoes and basil and little dressing making a salad with these little tomatoes and that leads me to the mini cucumbers. I have been hooked on these mini cucumbers and they are not cheap. $3.99 for these little buggers, $3.99. But I love them. I've been eating them just as a snack because they're small. They don't have any calories and they're really good for hydration and your skin and I like them. So I've been grabbing them every time I go shopping. And I did grab some provolone cheese for my sandwiches. Those were $1.99. The Mrs. Fields were completely free because I had the load to app coupon. If you guys haven't seen my video how to use the app, Stop and Shop app, I did just recently do a video and I will put it in the description box for you guys to take a peek how simple this app is to use. Probably the simplest app ever and you can get some freebies. I did grab a Jubilee roll for Thanksgiving. I grabbed Powerade at $3.99 for eight of them. I thought that was a good deal. I can tell I'm a little dehydrated, so Powerade to the rescue. I did grab um, the Coca-Cola guys. If you buy five of them, they are just 77 cents a piece. I grabbed some oatmeal cookie um, in the bag. Mix. I don't even really like oatmeal cookies, but I really like oatmeal cookie dough. And I really like oatmeal cookies if I add a ton of chocolate chips to them. So I did grab one of these. They're just so super simple. Everything is just right in the package. I just add an egg and butter, a little bit of water. You're good to go. Um, I did grab milk. I'm going to use Ibotta. They had a 25 cent rebate on milk and a 25 cent any rebate. So I'm going to use those. These are $1.69. My absolute favorite water, and it's alkaline water. I don't know if you guys 
have ever heard of that, but it's naturally alkaline and it has a natural pH of 7.8 to 8.2. I have acid reflux and Barrett's esophagus. So this water, believe it or not, soda does not give me acid reflux. Powerade, that Powerade right there, and this water, or regular water, gives me acid reflux. The alkaline water does not, so that is why I spend a little more and get it. Um, these are actually, what size? I think it's like 1.5 liters or something. Uh, it's a one liter. It's one liter and they're on sale for a little less than $1.50. So I really love this water and I love the bottle. Isn't it so pretty? Absolutely love it. The Honey Bunches of Oats, these are on sale for $1.99. It's my favorite cereal. I've never tried the pecan and maple brown sugar, so I'm going to give that a try. Hopefully, I'll like it. But yeah, so I have breakfast. I have lunch. I have snacks. I have meals. I have treats. Um, I have lots of drinks. I actually drink more than I eat. Um, I always have more beverages than anything in my house. So that is it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, the bread. If you don't get the Stop and Shop bread, guys, I know it's just plain white bread, but that stuff, I am like one of those weird people that if you open your bread in like two days, you can absolutely smell like whatever that is. Um, their bread stays for days. Like this is the only bread that I don't waste money on. I don't know why that it's like that. It takes so long to go stale. You never get like that... I don't know what the smell is or I don't know what the texture is, but it changes in texture and like, I don't know. I don't know. You guys will know and you'll tell me in the description box exactly what I'm talking about because I'm sure you understand me. You guys know me by now. You understand what I'm saying. So this bread is amazing and it's only 99 cents. All right, guys. I probably forgot one thing on the table because you know that's what I always do, but I'm starving. So I'm going to go eat dinner. Thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a vid big... I'm not, re I'm not redoing the video. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you would like to see more grocery hauls, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.